100. It's a song of praise. It's a song of thanksgiving. You know, the songs are written by individuals who have experienced something with God in God. The song happens to be a song of praise. It's a post-exilic song. It was because while they were in captivity, God sustained them. Would you tell your neighbor, while I was going through my mess, the Lord sustained me. I didn't lose my mind. I didn't lose my mind. I experienced anxiety. Come on, I'm one real people. I experienced anxiety, but I didn't lose my mind. God held on to me. God kept me while I was going through. He sustained me until he delivered me. Hallelujah. He's a God that's able. He's a God that will deliver. Just talking. He said, Wow, the enemy was doing this mess. He hit me. Anybody know that the Lord hit you? Squeeze somebody by the hand and tell him, he hit me too. And wait a minute. And for those of you who may have slipped up a time or two. I tell your neighbor, I want to testify that he's a God that will restore. He's a God that will revive. Tell him he made all things brand new. So the writer says, I want to write about I want to write about his goodness. He's been good to me. I can't begin to tell you all the things he's done. But what I want to do is this. He pins his words. Make a joyful noise. Unto the Lord. Now wait a minute. He goes on to speak of who he's talking about. I love it. He starts listing who he is. The Lord make a joyful noise unto the Lord. For the Lord is good. Huh? Then he labels him as the creator. It is he who am And now we are sad. He labels him as a shepherd. We are his. God. Tell him that's worth the praise. That's worth the praise. Tell him that's worth the praise. I belong to God. Then the next thing you
you understand? After he describes who he is, he speaks of his attributes. For the Lord is good. She's merciful. She's faithful. Anybody know the Lord's faithful? Praise him right there. Praise him right there. Praise him for his faithfulness. Praise him for his faithfulness. 